is the so this is the front and the back of the original microphone there's probably a little bit of mains hum simply because I haven't got the circuit enclosed but you can hear a significant reduction in noise so this is the front and this is the back here we have the cardioid microphone much lower noise front and back so there's the back and there's the front and here we have the uh, figure of eight for the side for mid side arrangement so as I turn it there you can hear that we're really properly figure of eight and there we are returning on the other side so on the same setting here's the bearing of B1 so this is the front and that is the back and here we have the bearing of B2 Pro on figure of eight and you can hear the higher noise there it is on cardioid on which there's less noise so that is the front and that is the back so there is the front and there is figure of eight so that's the front and this is the side and you can hear a slight reduction there and this is the back there we are on omni where we seem to have more noise but it works this is the Behringer C3 after modification it's quite quiet and this is the Omni and it's quite even all the way round the cardioid this is from behind and this is in front that's in the figure of eight so this is behind and I'm talking as I'm rotating it to give you the idea of the figure of eight and for comparison here we have the cheap microphone with the same units there's a bit more handling noise but there's a very very good figure of eight response there here's the bearing of B1 here we have the cardioid microphone for comparison this is an AKG D202 highly respected dynamic microphone 